Leonte Carew, Miami Dolphins. What's your favorite Madden video game memory that you can share with us from growing up? Uh, my my uh, favorite Madden memory um, is definitely when I played my dad, and uh, he beat me at Madden about 67-0. Uh, my first time ever playing, and he, uh, <laughs> he just beat me really bad. Who's your go-to team in Madden and why? Uh, my go-to team in Madden is the um, Seahawks, and just because of the, the defense that they play, and you know, um, I'm a big time scramble quarterback on Madden, so I just need a quarterback that's a little bit more mobile, so I tend to use Russell Wilson. What are your thoughts on how far the Madden franchise has come over the years? Um, my thoughts on how far the Madden franchise has come over the years is, is it's actually tremendous. You know, uh, it doesn't really allow you to, to cheat anymore. Like, it's, it's more realistic. You know, when I was a kid, I used to just create a bunch of players, try to put them on one team, and, and then go from there. But now, you know, you, it, it makes you, you know, it kind of forces you to be kind of good, somewhat good at Madden. One of the new features of Madden 17 is the focus on the running game. What do you see that opening up for the franchise? Um, well, one of the, one of those features, is, as far as the run game, um, I feel like as far as the Madden franchise, it, it's probably going to open up tremendously. It's actually really hard to, to run the ball in Madden. It's more of a, a passing game, so you know, um, I feel like that feature will definitely be, be exciting. Madden 17 will also have new defensive AI, including gap play, force defenders, and improved zone coverages. What do you see that opening up for the game? Uh, those coverages opening up for the game will be, uh, you know, very exciting. Especially, like I said, it, it, it's a it's a pass first type of game. So, you know, uh, you just having those type of schemes on defense uh, will, will definitely, you know, allow interceptions and, and not allow people like Peyton Manning or Tom Brady just tear you apart in the game. EA is also improving the Madden franchise mode. Do you have a favorite franchise memory you can share with us? Uh, my favorite franchise memory is uh, when I was a kid. You know, I would, I would always, you know, create a lot of players, put them on a the team and go into franchise mode and just play season after season after season and try to win every single Super Bowl that uh, repeatedly every single year. Probably the most important question is, what are your thoughts on the player ratings EA gave you in Madden 17? Uh, my thoughts on the uh, player rating that Madden, uh, that Madden gave me this year is, um, you know, a bit harsh, you know, <laughs> but, um, like, like they told me in there, you know, Odell Beckham started off with a 74 and finished with a 92 rating. You know, I'm starting off with a 70 overall rating, and uh, you know, we'll see where it goes from there. How good are you at Madden? Uh, I'm pretty good. You know, I, I, like I said, I play with the Seahawks. You know, um, I play against, I play a lot, I play against my friends back at home. So, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm a pretty decent player. What advice or strategies would you give to someone playing the Miami Dolphins in Madden 17? Uh, an advice that I would give someone playing in my I am at offense in Madden 17 would be uh, definitely key on Jarvis Landry and Devontae Parker and now Leontay Carew. You know, uh, going into the game, you know, you should probably try to stop our offense because it's, it's pretty strong. What are some of your What are your thoughts on players like Terry Bridgewater using Madden to prepare for the NFL? Uh, my thoughts on guys like Terry Bridgewater using Madden to prepare for for a game is uh, pretty crazy. Uh, you know, it's, it's kind of you know hard to bring a video game into a real life situation. So that's that's pretty interesting, actually. Do you think you'll use Madden to help acclimate to the NFL? Um, I will not use Madden to acclimate to the NFL. You know, it's <laughs> it's not uh, realistic at all comparing you know real life football to a video game. But QB vision, I'm just kidding. <laughs> the best ever, right? Um, but uh, do you feel like playing Madden uh, all these years has helped you with your real football knowledge? Um, Madden, playing Madden all these years has not helped me with my football knowledge. You know, being that each team pretty much runs the same plays and the same defense on Madden. But, uh, you know, it definitely helped me with my video game skills and, you know, being able to play and, and compete with people on Madden. How popular was Madden in college? Uh, in college, Madden was very popular. You know, you were going against you know, your teammates every single day, your friends from home, and you know, it was just a, a way to break ice with someone, even if you just met them, like, hey, you wanna play Madden? And you could always just have Madden be your go-to. What do you think has kept the Madden franchise going strong for so many years? Um, what kept the Madden franchise uh, going strong for so many years is uh, their ability to just make, make the game better every single year. And also, you know, just really uh, boosting guys' ratings. You know, they don't, 
they don't make you know guys pretty much the, the same every single year. You know, guys either grow up and, and it, it gets exciting, and you know uh, how they put. You know how Odell had that one hand catch, and now it seems like you can make catches like that on Madden 16 like it's nothing. So that that's pretty cool. When did you realize the Madden game had become a pop culture phenomenon? Um, I realized Madden. Uh, has been came, became a phenomenon when uh, the hit stick came out and uh, it was just making people fumble left and right and um, you know people were just hit sticking people and the QB vision and that's when I realized like this game is here to stay for, for many years and I think that was actually mad in 2006 when Donovan McNabb was on the front cover when uh, or was it McNabb? I think so. Yeah when, <clears throat> when the hit stick came out so. <clears throat> what do you like to play outside of Madden? What I like to play outside of Madden is definitely uh, NBA 2K. Um, you know, that's the next best game besides Madden. Some people are Call of Duty guys, some people are FIFA guys. You know, I'm a 2K and Madden guy. So who's your go-to team in 2K? Uh, my go-to team in 2K is uh, definitely the um, OKC, OKC uh, Thunder. You know, um, they're just unbelievable. You can't stop uh, Russell Westbrook and, you know, it's just great. How do you think your video gaming is going to be impacted by that NFL playbook this year? Uh, my NFL video gaming uh, shouldn't be impacted by NFL playbook at all. You know, like I said, you can't compare <laughs> real life to a video game. So. What are your thoughts on the Madden Bowl EA is hosting at the rookie event this week? Uh, my thoughts on the Madden Bowl uh, that EA is hosting this week is going to be very competitive. You know, uh, you're going to get guys from all different teams playing with their teams and. When it comes to that, it's going to come down to pride. You know, I don't think guys are going to play with their favorite, you know, uh, Madden teams that they played with before. Guys are going to play with their teams that they're on now, and it's going to get real competitive. Are you going to take it home tonight? Are you, are you in the Madden Bowl? Did you sign up for it? Uh, I did sign up for it. Are you so going to take it home? If I'm playing, I'm taking that thing home. <laughs> do you know there are now pro gamers playing esports like Madden in competitions for money? As a pro athlete, what do you think of esports? Uh, I think esports as a pro athlete is it, great. You know, I used to watch a TV show back in the day where they used to go on a tour bus and play Madden, and uh, it was pretty cool. You know, I used to watch it all the time. It was on ESPN, and they used to play Madden against each other. And you know, I think it's just a way for people to just get a chance to compete against each other. So, were you ever good enough at video games like 2K or Madden that you think you could have became a professional gamer? I was never good at video games to become a professional gamer. You know, uh, I don't play that much to be that to become a professional those type of guys they play you know all day all night you know um so i probably no i'm not that good <laughs>